all the way to Lhasa. To Miss Rebecca, with love from the Appleseeds families, 2017 to 2018. Long ago, in the land of Tibet, an old woman sat by the road to the holy city of Lhasa. A horse and rider came galloping up to her. How far is it to Lhasa? Very far, said the old woman. You'll never make it there before night. But the rider kicked his horse and galloped off as fast as a horse can run. Then a boy came walking along with his yak, one foot in front of the other. How far is it to Lhasa? He asked. Very far, said the old woman, but you can make it there before night. So the boy gave his yak a gentle tug and kept on walking. One foot in front of the other, he climbed a steep and windy slope. He thought the torrents would sweep him away. He thought the dark would come and he would never make it to the holy city of Lhasa. But still, the boy kept walking on and on with his steady yak, one foot in front of the other. Then he came to a fallen horse and rider. They had run so hard they could run no more. And there they lay, snoring. The boy wanted to lie down too, but he gave his yak a gentle tug and kept on walking. Then, in the last rays of sun before night, he called, he heard deep horns calling. He heard bells, silly lee, and drums, drolololo. Imaho, he had made it. One foot in front of the other. All the way. 
to the holy city of Lhasa. <laughs>